Monday, Monday. Yay, it's another week. Woo. This last week was a two day week and therefore I'm feeling quite good um, today. So what is happening? Um, today is quite a kind of worky, kind of at homey, desky type day. I am going to the gym later, hence the full view of my hormonal breakout that you are enjoying at the moment um, and the uh, exciting gym wear that I'm wearing. Ooh, exciting gym wear, like I'm wearing leggings and everything. Um, and so yeah, I'm just getting a bit of work done now, I'm grabbing some breakfast, then I'll go to the gym. Uh, this week, anything exciting happening? Um, probably vlogging a launch party that I'm going to, sounds very glamorous. Um, so going to some cocktails and things on Tuesday night, so we'll no doubt take you there with me. Um, also, I've got a hospital appointment this week. Um, finally going to go and see a consultant about the dermatitis I've been getting on my face. So I'm really looking forward to seeing whether we can actually work out what's causing it and whether I can sort that out because God, I miss lipstick. In fact, I've written an entire blog post about missing lipstick um, and sort of generally the whole dermatitis story thing. So if you want to read that, I'll stick the link down here somewhere. So um, yeah, come join me in my week. <laughs> from the hospital uh where i went for my immunology oh sorry i'm like woo swaying on my chair and it's probably going to make you feel a bit seasick um, i just got out from the hospital from the uh i had an immunology appointment to try and work out what the hell's going on with my face um because i've been suffering from some uh skin issues around my lips and around my eye um for ages now um and the good news is that i'm not allergic to to cheese hooray uh, i've not eaten any dairy for like six weeks and it's been painful um but i don't have a dairy allergy um so now i get the fun of trying to reintroduce dairy and see what happens to my face um the bad news is that i wasn't allergic to any of the other things that they tested me for either you can see i've got a a fun arm full of pinpricks there you go there is my arm all the tests and as you can see i am allergic to nothing there are no giant red bumps there or anything so yeah the next step is being referred to a dermatologist where apparently they'll do loads more tests um more extensive tests to see what on earth is irritating my lips um which will be fantastic because i miss lipstick so much so much like my face just doesn't feel finished without it so um i'm actually really happy because i feel like something's actually happening now because it's been going on since september october time last year so yeah so now i'm back at home um and i have got some work to do and then later on i'm going to uh, an event it's an event for grand central which is the new massive uh, shopping centre that is opening above New Street Station in Birmingham and we're getting our first John Lewis and lots of other exciting shops um, and the, I'm one of their bloggers um, so I'm going on to an event this afternoon to kind of a bit of a meet and greet to sort of see who's involved with the project so that should be really good.
so uh, this happened and um, today my face is kind of sore so maybe I was a little bit um, a little bit preemptive in going on a bit of a cheese fest last night looks like uh, the quest to sort out my skin continues It's been a really quiet weekend actually we went out friday night which wasn't so quiet and therefore yesterday was really quiet um so went out for my friend's birthday which was really good fun and today has mostly been a cleaning day i feel like i've been cleaning the flat all day because there's been loads of stuff that needs sorting out uh, but now the flat is all pristine and lovely and that is very nice um and cleaning is quite boring so i can't really talk about that in any more detail what I'm going to do now is going to be a little bit more fun. I've been waiting to do this for ages. Um, well, since my birthday, I got given for my birthday. Oh, I'm going to reach. It wasn't a very flattering camera angle. Uh, got given for my birthday this awesome fabric. Oh, oh, oh. There it is. Awesome foxy fabric. Um, uh, got given that by my bestie, uh, future matron of honour. And uh, I'm going to make that into a dress. So I will not obviously make that into a dress just on a Sunday evening. But I will hopefully get it cut out and you'll be able to see a little bit of the sort of sewing stuff that I do. Because it is one of my favourite things to do, is to make pretty dresses to wear. And this one's going to be awesome because it's going to have foxes on it. So, brilliant. So basically, the idea is now that through sewing magic, we turn this into this. Ooh, pretty dress. Um, I've made this dress quite a few times before. That doesn't mean I'm not incredibly nervous every time I come. Um, yes, the sewers amongst you will have noticed that I have just cut the pattern straight out and not traced it. Uh, I am a horrible, horrible, lazy sewer. Um, and if this video reveals anything, it will be that, uh, as you see me sew away. Basically, I like to get from fabric to dress as quickly as possible and will cut as many corners as I can to get there. I'm not proud of it and you shouldn't copy me. say goodbye for this week because it's getting dark and quite frankly you won't be able to see me later i've also made something that looks vaguely like the top half of a dress you can probably see over my shoulder just there um so i hope you had a really good week and uh, i'll catch you next monday <laughs>